Heaven has come. Heaven has invaded the earth. Yes, Lord God, we just thank you, Lord. Oh, we honor and worship you, Lord. We glorify your holy name. God, we just thank you that you're moving across us just right now. And us individually, us corporately, we are experiencing the wonder of worship to the King of Kings, God. I'm a server. I've been working in um, like Tampa Clearwater area and we live in Port Ritchie for a long time. And I have been like, God, this is wear and tear on my car. It's an hour drive. So Matt came across something. I said there was a job opening for a server in um, New Port Ritchie. So way closer to my house, like 25 minutes door to door at the very, between the two of us, we have five boys. So we need, I need to be close. Maybe a week later, I felt very strongly the Holy Spirit. And he said, go there today. Just walk in the door, just walk in the door. I'm like, okay. I walked in the door and, and said, oh, I haven't, I said, I applied. He, he said, I haven't even seen your application. Turns out I applied to a different county. I'm like, I'm so sorry. He's like, okay, well, that's okay. Here, he gives me a paper application, just fill this out. And he comes and sits down right next to me and just starts talking to me. It turns out that both him and I are from very, very, like two miles away from each other in Michigan, the same city. Goes into the office, comes back with onboarding paperwork, a uniform for me, and an apron. It's like, start this week, Monday. I'm like, thank you, God. Guys, it truly is that we stand to gain so much more when we lay down our lives because God will always take care of his children. And sometimes it's good to like look back at your life and see all the things that God has brought you through and remind yourself of his faithfulness so that you can prepare your heart for the season that lies ahead. You know, like you think about the Israelites, like the moment they had this like crazy amnesia, the moment like God brought them through the Red Sea and they're like, oh my gosh, where are we gonna find food? It's like, dude, did you see what just happened? Like, do you really think that God is gonna bring you into the wilderness and then leave you here to die? Like sometimes and remind ourselves of his past faithfulness. Spot. You pray for the job and he gives it to you, but guys, there's no limit. There's no end to what you can ask. Because, guys, the body of Christ is active. Guys, the body of Christ is moving on this earth, and it's shaking things up, and it's changing things. And, guys, let me tell you, it's not always comfortable, but he's going to do it.